everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we'll be discussing about blanket orders in Order 40. So basically there are two types of purchase agreements. One is blanket order and other one is call for tender. So blanket order is a purchase agreement type in which a customer places with the suppliers to allow multiple delivery dates over a period of time and with predefined pricing. So bulk amounts of products are purchased in a specific period of time. So it is an agreement type for long term transaction. So when we are, pur when we are purchasing a product from a single vendor, we create blanket orders. So first of all, inside purchase module, we have to enable purchase agreements inside the configuration settings. So basically purchase agreements are some terms and conditions between seller and buyer while purchasing or selling a product purchasing a product so here you can see the option that is purchase agreement so you have to enable that in order to manage the call for tenders or blanket orders so after enabling them that option you can see a menu that is purchase agreement types so when you open it there are two options there are two agreements already created by default we have that is call for tender and blanket order so you can create new one uh, but basically we used to use these agreement types so now let us open blanket order where we can find some details given with agreement type this is actually the agreement name that is this is the name of the agreement type then agreement selection type so this one is important uh, like in case of blanket order we used to set this option that is select multiple rfq as we are purchasing a product like creating quotations with same vendor like we are purchasing a product from a single vendor so here in this case we can create using this agreement type we can create multiple requests for quotations and confirm them so we can set this option then data for new quotations here we have two fields that is lines and quantities so in case of lines like while we're creating a quotation whether the lines like product lines order lines need to uh, be created automatically like, like by using the lines from the agreement or do not create rfq lines automatically so we can select according to our need so i'm setting this use lines of agreement then we have quantities so inside the quotation whether to use quantities that we have given inside the agreement or to set quantities manually so in case of blanket orders it is better to set quantities manually like in case of when we, are, when we want to create multiple RFQs so after saving this it is already saved there. so here under products sorry under orders we can see purchase agreements so let us create a new one here you can see the purchase ag representative agreement type you can select so let's make it as blanket order so as it is a blanket order it is mandatory to set a vendor So you can set a vendor for this product sorry for this agreement and here we have agreement deadline so within this deadline we have to purchase a product then ordering date we can add delivery date can be added source document like purchase order can be added here then operation type automatically it will be received you can change that then company name here we can add a product Is 
by contest right then quantity to be purchased for which the agreement is created so 10 for 10 quantities then it is important to set the pricing as it is blanket order pricing need to be set inside the agreement so we price 100 for this vendor ready mat and can add some terms and conditions if necessary inside this so it is a description box so we can add terms and conditions and after saving you can see them then we can confirm this agreement so here you can see a new uh, tab that is RFQs or orders so from here itself we can create a new quotation So here when creating a quotation you can see the vendor is automatically added to this uh, page quotation form then if you want to add a vendor reference you can add that then you can see the purchase agreement is added here then order deadline can be seen then receive date then source document can be viewed here then you can see the product line so this is the order line that is given inside the, that was given inside the agreement and as we have set inside the agreement type configuration of the blanket order agreement type as uh, lines should be taken from the agreement it is automatically added here from the agreement then under other information you can see the Purchase, you can add a purchase representative, journal, company, deliver to, then print parent groups, then payment terms, then fiscal position. Okay, that's not. Now, let's add the quantity here. As we have uh, set inside agreement type configuration, that quantity need to be set manually. So, we can set that manually here. Suppose I'm creating quotation for 5. So, within the order deadline, like within the agreement deadline we have to purchase a complete quantities so first of all let's create a quotation for five quantities suppose I'm creating quotation for five quantities and we can send mail also uh, again I can also create a new quotation so before that let me show one thing you can see our count increased to one then you can create a new quotation so here I'm changing the quantity as five then sending by email so again the RFQ is sent by email to ReadyMint. Then again if I come back you can see two RFQs. So RFQ is sent and if you click on this you can see status as RFQ sent and you can see the total amount here. So as we have a set inside, inside the agreement that amount per that is unit price is 100 for 5 quantities you can see 500 and the uh, for other quotation also for five, for five quantities you can see 500 so when you open this from here itself you can confirm order and receive the product so multiple uh, RFQs can be created and can confirm the order to see the products so we have created agreement and created purchase orders quotations and confirmed it and to see the products and if you go to that product corner disk right you can see one thing that under purchase tab can see the agreement 
so here this is our vendor ready mat and can see the agreement corresponding to that vendor and the price so that's all about blanket orders in order 14 if you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any order implementation or customization in your business drop your request to odo at cyprocess.com